Ito May the Sardine Queen was a humble creature, living a simple life deep in the heart of the Amazon rainforest. She spent her days swimming in the calm waters, and playing with the other fish in the river. She was content with her life, living in harmony with the world around her. However, one day, everything changed. A group of fishermen came to the Amazon River looking to catch some fish for dinner at night. They cast their nets into the water, not realizing that they were intruding on Jose's territory. Suddenly, Jose found herself caught in the fisherman's net. She struggled, and fought but was eventually pulled out of the water, and onto their boat. The fishermen were excited to have caught such a unique fish, and immediately began planning what they were going to cook with their catch. The thought of being turned into someone's dinner filled Jose with anger, and frustration. She tried to muster her strength, and escape but was too weak after being caught in the net. It was then that she remembered something her grandmother had told her long ago. Jose, channel your inner anger, and transform into your true form. You are the Sardine Queen, a powerful being in the Amazon River. With this thought, Jose concentrated hard, and transformed into a three-meter-tall giant fish robot. The fishermen were shocked, and terrified as they scrambled to get off the boat. But, Jose was not finished yet. She looked around, and saw the humans' homes littering both sides of the river. She knew that these humans were responsible for polluting the Amazon, and destroying her home. She picked up a nearby tree, and threw it at the nearest house, watching as it crumbled, and fell to the ground. With each house she destroyed, her anger, and frustration dissipated. Jose continued on her rampage, destroying everything in her path until there was nothing left. She looked out at the, once beautiful rainforest, and saw the destruction that had been wrought by the humans. But, she also knew that her actions would make sure that no human would ever enter her home again. From that day forward, Jose was known as the protector of the Amazon, the Sardine Queen, who fought against the humans, and saved the rainforest. She lived a peaceful life under the water, but her legend grew, and became known throughout the world. People would tell the story of the Sardine Queen, and no one ever dared come back to the Amazon to hunt, or fish. Jose's legacy would live on forever.